Hey everyone and welcome back to Costume Quest. We just beat, I guess, a minor boss. It seems we're heading in the right direction. Oh hey, look at all the candy. All the candy. Will those things teleport us back? Because I hope so. That would be quite nice. Autumn Pines, or... Okay. Yeah, let's go back to the mall. Oh, we gotta find that other kid. Actually, I'm gonna save. Save. Let me save. Thank you. Okay. So, I think there's also two treasure chests that we haven't gotten. And one of them... Right there. Move, guys. I don't. How do I? How do I do that? Uh, ninja? Can I sneak over there? No. I yeah. I don't know how to get that. But maybe we can get the pumpkin one. There is one that's in a pumpkin. Down here, I think. Also, we could probably check out the stamps. See what we have. Bowl of bloodshot eyeballs greatly increases critical strike damage. Lethal poison applies a powerful damage over time effect. I guess we could get that. Get that. So we only have two left. Only two left. Where is that missing kid, though? That's my question. Hey, I'm a fellow pumpkin. Let me in. Let me in to get this. I would like to have that treasure chest. Do you not respect my pumpkin authority? Okay, so I figured out how to get the one treasure chest. You have to go down this way once you go in the passageway by the arcade. So you come in here, and there it is. So we got it. Ah, so that is for the unicorn costume, I'm assuming. Yes. Seen one more for the vampire costume and two for the unicorn, and that—that's it, right? Yeah. Okay. Well, is there anything? Oh. Okay. Candy. I'll take it. Is that it? Well, there's the pumpkin, though. Pumpkin's like right there. But how do I get there? Oh! Oh, just candy. I want pieces of costume! <laughs> Alright, so I finally figured out how to get the treasure chest that's in the pumpkin. You have to come up here, it's like two floors above it. And there's this uh, little area of railing, and you can just fall down. So, there you go. Is it the last... Part of the unicorn costume? A second. Second. Okay, we need one more for that. All right, after much searching, I finally found the last kid hiding in the mall. So. We got a candy pill upgrade, pumpkin pail, and 500 experience points, but we already have the bigger um, bat bucket, so it doesn't really matter. Um, I mean, aside from the experience, which is nice, but we only have, I think, one more thing to find in the mall, and that is the last part of the unicorn costume. So, I'm gonna go look around for that. Alright, so I happen to find another area of the railing that's broken off, so I think I can jump over here. 
Oh. Oh, okay, there we go. Candy, really? That's not what I wanted. No, that's not what I wanted. Well, I found it. All you had to do was go up this escalator here, which I just must have missed. And it's it's up here. If this is not the unicorn costume, I'm going to be very upset. <laughs> Aha. Well, look at me. Why does my butt look weird? Oh, it's like a cardboard box attached to my butt. Well then. Okay, so we have one more costume to complete. Let's see. The unicorn is a magic type, which makes sense. Uh, okay. Revives KO party member and heals them to full health. Okay. So we'll have to, we'll have to give that a shot. I guess I'll make him the robot and her the... Hmm. pumpkin and then we'll uh, switch out some battle stamps so I want I want Everett to have this one uh greatly increased critical strike damage we could give that a shot uh yeah let's do the increased critical strike all right okay so we're gonna head back to uh I forget what it's called what is it called? Fall Valley, I guess. And try to find the rest of the vampire costume. So I'll see you there. Alright, well, I guess we'll see how the unicorn fights. Oh my gosh, look at that mystical unicorn. <laughs> Okay. Wow. That was a pretty strong attack. Jeez. I wonder how strong that would be if I gave, uh, Ren, the increased attack. Wrecked. Oh, we leveled up. Sweet. Oh, definitely want to save here. Yeah. All right. Well, we'll have to check out the stamps as well. And I, I think we're fully leveled. I don't think we can level up anymore. Because the candy thing is full. So... Look at that. Alright, let's go get some stamps. Wait, is it because... Hold on. Oh. Okay. Well, can we go in here? Haha! -ha, there it is! Alright, so now we have all the costumes. And I think we have everything. I think we have, like... Uh, except the stamps now, now that I think of it. We need two more stamps. But... Everything else, we've got all the costumes all of the cards, so awesome. All right, so the vampire is a magic type, focuses on attack. Hmm, that looks pretty cool. I think what I'm gonna do is have Ren stay as the unicorn and then do uh, Lucy as the vampire. Okay, so, I think we're good, so we'll go get, oh, that's where that comes out, well, that works. We'll go get the stamp, we already got this, right? Yeah. 
I think we pretty much have gotten everything. Uh, like I said, aside from the stamps, there might be a chest or two that we could possibly be missing with candy in it, but I, I don't know. I don't think so. I'm not really too concerned about it. Because we've been pretty good on candy this whole time. So. Maybe I'll actually, maybe I'll make Ren the robot. Everett can be the vampire and Lucy can be the unicorn. All right. And then we'll switch their stamps around. I just want to move faster. <laughs> I like the unicorn, though. Okay. Alright, well, we're only missing one. And I think... I think we might get that... after beating... her? Or after beating another mini-boss? Or something? Alright, so we are gonna head back and confront the monsters and stop them once and for all, but we are gonna do that in the next episode. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up, cheer support. It really helps me out. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.